The Eco Laboratory is a high capacity open air facility used to understand how environmental challenges such as climate change and pollution affect water resources and ecosystems. The facility has been developed as part of a £1.2 million investment by the University of Birmingham in environmental change research and education. Understanding environmental change requires experimentation to link cause to effect. And here in Birmingham, we use mesocosms, artificial streams and ponds, to understand the genes to ecosystems' consequences of stresses acting on multi-species systems. Mesocosms are ideal for this purpose because they combine the ecological realism of field studies with the control and replicability of laboratory experiments. In addition to our array of mesocosms, the facility has a variety of control and monitoring systems to enable environmental conditions to be regulated with a high degree of precision. Users of the facility can manipulate and standardise light, heat, physical structure and water chemistry in ways not possible at other facilities in the UK. We work with industry to develop new water quality sensors. Our knowledge transfer partnership with a local instrumentation company has led to the development of optical sensors for monitoring dissolved organic matter. The sensor network we have here at Eco Laboratory enables us to monitor a range of environmental parameters including dissolved oxygen, electrical conductivity, water temperature, light and water depth. We can do this in real time and assess ecosystem responses to stresses. We can also use these measurements in feedback control loops to manipulate environmental conditions in the flumes. The wide range of automated actuators, pumps, valves and heaters can be controlled automatically using these near real-time measurements as control inputs. In our current funded research, we're exploring how cocktails of pollutants, including nanoparticles, microplastics and pesticides, affect stream ecology. And we're also undertaking temperature and flow regime manipulations to establish how extreme events, such as heat waves and droughts, affect river life.